Hey, Psych2Goers, have you ever thought about joining our team of animators? Or perhaps you want to start an animation channel of your own? Today's video is sponsored by Skillshare. It's a great place where you can learn new things with their online classes, and they have courses on animation as well. You get a two month free trial by clicking the link in the description below. Hey there, Psych2Go fam. Before we begin, we want to thank you for your support on our channel. Our aim is to make psychology and mental health information engaging and accessible to you. And we hope you learn new things from our content. So thanks again, let's begin. Attractiveness is defined as certain qualities or features that make a person more desirable and alluring to others. It can significantly influence people's attitudes. And it's one of the most common reasons people become interested in psychology. What is it exactly that makes someone so attractive? Which of these traits do we look for in a friend or partner? According to psychology, here are eight of the most common things that make a person attractive. Number one, confidence. Studies have shown that confidence is the most attractive quality a person can have. When someone is confident, you're less likely to second guess yourself and you know and believe in your value. People notice when someone is confident in who they are and what they believe in. And although it's common to imagine someone who is confident as outgoing and charismatic, confidence can also be quiet. Knowing your worth, believing in your strengths, and taking pride in who you are is what makes you confident, regardless of if you're outgoing or not. Two, availability. Availability is an important factor in how much we find someone attractive. Despite the common belief that we need to act distant or aloof to make people we like interested in us, the opposite is actually true. When we're developing new relationships, it's important to find someone who can physically and emotionally be there for us. And the more responsive, attentive, and reliable someone is, the more we will come to value our relationship with them. Three, uniqueness. Although there are 7 billion people in the world, each of us is unique in our own ways. No one looks, talks, acts, thinks, or feels in exactly the same way. And that's what makes us so amazing but some people prefer to hide their uniqueness to fit in. When we learn to embrace what makes us special, whether it's our looks, experiences, ideas, or little quirks, we open ourselves up to the possibility of meeting new, engaging, and like-minded people. Number four, kindness. Kindness is a quality that lots of people want in a friend or romantic partner. In a study done by Baskerville and colleagues in the year 2000, they found that people tend to like people who showed more kindness, sympathy, and compassion than those who showed lesser levels of kindness. At the end of the day, we all wanna be with someone who treats us as well as we would like to be treated. Five, intelligence. Intelligence is attractive because it often leads to stimulating conversations, deep insights, and a new way to look at the world. A recent study in 2018 by psychologists Ginyak and others found that for most participants, there is a particular IQ score that maximizes an individual's attractiveness, but any higher would make them seem less desirable. In other words, people are attracted to those they perceive as more intelligent than them, but not so much that they become too intimidating or out of reach to talk to. Six, passion. Next is passion, the enthusiasm and desire to achieve a certain goal. People who are passionate tend to be driven, determined, and self-motivated, but more importantly, they have things that matter a lot to them and that they care about significantly. They have an interest in big dreams that appeal to the optimist in all of us, which can inspire us to push ourselves to be better as well. Seven, a sense of humor. Research has shown that we tend to be more attracted to the people who make us laugh, possibly because it shows cleverness, wit, and creativity. So it should come as no surprise that having a good sense of humor ranks high on the list of characters people look for in an ideal friend or partner. In heterosexual relationships, women in particular gravitate towards men they find funny, while men favor women who are playful and good humored. And number eight, their demeanor. Last but not least is our demeanor. While it's no secret that a person's looks have a lot to do with how attractive we find them, there's a lot more to it than someone's physical traits. Psychologists have found that it takes us only 30 seconds to decide whether we find someone attractive and our demeanor can make or break someone's impression of us. The way we dress, act, and carry ourselves also plays a part in how people perceive us. When meeting new people, it can be helpful to take note of these things as they can make a world of a difference. 
While it's common for us to base attractiveness off a person's physical traits, attractiveness can actually be more complex than that. And though we all have different ideas of what makes someone more or less attractive, these are some of the most common and widely agreed upon traits. So, do you agree with the things we've mentioned in this video? Do you also find these traits and qualities attractive? Leave us a comment down below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. For similar topics, you can watch more in our videos, seven psychological things that can make us less attractive. See you soon. Did you relate to any of the points in this video? What do you think of the animation? Let us know in the comments below. Before we wrap up this video, we wanna mention that we're happy to have Skillshare as a sponsor today because they really promote the idea of a self-made you. Are you planning to learn a new skill, perhaps on illustration, animation, or writing? Are you looking through as many YouTube channels as you can for tutorials and tips, but waste a lot of time on some not so helpful ones? It would be great if everything you needed was all in one place. Skillshare has thousands of catered courses across all kinds of topics like design, business, tech, and more. There is truly something for everyone. Skillshare has a great intro class on animation that we really recommend. The course is called Animation for Illustration, Adding Movement with Procreate and Photoshop by Libby Vanderplug. If any of you are interested in learning basic animation, I recommend you go check out the link below. The first 1,000 people will get a two month free trial. And after that, it's only around $10 a month. Let us know what Skillshare courses you're taking in the comments below. As always, thanks for watching.